Gary Goldsmith has been speaking out in Big Brother. It's like listening to the Oracle, isn't it? And he thinks that Prince Harry will have to come back and be part of the gang. He's been talking to Sharon Osbourne, another Oracle. I remember seeing her in the Nativity. Uh, it was like a private audience with Mary. As it is, as it is, we're recovering from the news about Prince Harry and Cherry Royal, which smacks, uh, I, there's, no, there's no easy word to say this, but it smacks of uh, blackmail. It may not be presented entirely as such, but uh, uh, if the story is authentic and if she has uh, demanded two million dollars uh, which apparently, allegedly, she has done in all the reports that have come out. That's just, uh, it's squalid, isn't it, really? I would ignore it if I were the prince, but... Uh, and all this because she chalked his billiard cue, uh, rearranged the balls, and wasn't um, registered. He, she didn't, she wasn't noticed. She didn't get... Uh, a sentence in the memoir. Well, ships that pass in the night, uh, billiard tables that get rearranged uh, by the staff. It's um, and, 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 until uh, until this thing became public, he probably didn't even know what her name was. I don't think it's I, I don't think it's perfect behaviour on the part of the prince, but uh, there's nothing there to see. And the news of the world is dead. Uh, and indeed, Cherry Royals, uh, I was gonna say WhatsApp account, and no, it's not WhatsApp, it's um, OnlyFans account has been blocked. So all her outlets are gone. I don't think this is a story that the prince needs to worry about. I think, um, I think if, if on day two or day three that Gary Goldsmith has been in the Big Brother house, he's starting to blabber about what, what little he knows, uh, as David Niven would have said, um, uh, displaying his... Uh, his um, inconsequentials uh i think he's a bigger i think he's a bigger problem than uh, uh cherry royal frankly uh but what he said last night it doesn't um it doesn't hurt the story at all and and i think it's reasonable to Include Harry was Harry was born for one thing, uh, and, and that is to support his brother, to support the royal family, and to and to do that job, and to be taken away from the one thing that he knows he can do and has been trained to do must be very difficult. And I understand, I appreciate that he felt there was a, a, an unwarranted attack on his wife and his family. And there probably was. Uh, the press are vicious when they want to be. Uh, they know which buttons to press. They press them all. And uh, Harry needed more support. Harry's always needed more support. And uh, ha Harry was deeply traumatized as a child. And we know why, we know how. And I, I think it's astonishing that anybody should think uh, a few years down the line he should man up and get over it. Nobody gets over that. Uh, his mother died in a most terrible way and he was made to go through the event in public. That's awful. And... You know, we, we, we were spectators to that event and we found it disturbing. He was there, he was at the centre, he was the subject of that event. 
Um, as I say, hashtag, give Harry a hug. <laughs>